we're at the pretty much the highest point in Burnside right now, it's, uh, which is the industrial park here in Dartmouth. This is part of a four pad development uh, the Harbin Group has decided to do. Um, we were involved with the wall for building one and then subsequently now the walls for building two and with potential for when they build the other three buildings. The problem here was to get the required height for the client for what, what the requirements were. Ray Rock is a good solution for this, pro for this uh, project because we do have to go high and we're able to do that with the mechanically stabilized earth wall. It gave us a, a good finish for the wall. It's a very attractive wall. Uh, we can get our height with it with uh, using GeoGrid and using mechanically stabilized earth. Um, so it was, a, it was a good match for this project. I think just with the, the scale of the, of, of the wall, especially with the Red Rock blocks, any situations that do come along, you can make changes on the fly to, to, to meet the needs for, for that particular section rather than have to redesign the entire wall like you would with a, with a cast and play system. And that was really helpful for us when we did get into a section where the, the elevations weren't matching up with what the survey had told us. Allowing us to be able to make those, those changes uh, with, within one section uh, was very it was very helpful and it was, it was very cost effective. This was a pretty successful wall. Mike uh, from Dexter, he uh, put 300 block in in one day, which is our record here, and he's very proud of that. He keeps asking if anybody breaks it. So.